got a little tired. You know, we just kept on going. You know, uh, the conditioning that we have um, is extremely well right now. And I think our guys are very conditioned and able to fight in the fourth quarter. You know, so and there's been games in the past where we didn't win the fourth quarter. We have been losing the fourth quarter. You know, not scoring uh, probably three points or no, no points. And I think that's the emphasis from last week and this week, trying to you know do what we got to do to score in the fourth quarter and, uh, and outscore them in the fourth quarter. Even with a national championship possibility, what does this SEC title mean? Uh, it means everything. You know, the SEC champions, uh, we fought for this. You know, even with the loss of Ole Miss, that's tough for you to have a loss uh, in your conference and still get to go together and fight and be able to win. You know, luckily things swayed in our way for a couple of SEC times to teams to get uh, lose, but even in that, you know, it's, it's tough with a loss in your, in your conflict to be able to pull it out. What was your first reaction to Lane's offense when you first saw it? You know, when you really knew what was, what was capable of this? Well, with me being a senior, I was all down for You know, I know, I know what type of guy he is. He, he scored a lot of points. Uh, he gets the ball to the guys who's hot and making plays. And uh, he do a great job of it. You know, and, he, and, and he's molded Blake into his offense to be able to make plays and, and see what the defense is seeing and seeing what he's seeing, you know, basically. So I think it all comes together. He's, he's a great coach, great guy, you know, on and off the field. So. From the mental side and studying side, how much different is this offense from the ones you've had? Uh, this offense is very uh, diverse. You know, we can get in a lot of formations and guys can stay in the same position and know what to do. You know, so and then we, then again we can put guys in different positions and also uh, translate different, different uh, formations, different, different shifts, different things that we can do that, that you know, allow guys to be able to. You know, make plays. What does, I guess, Lane Kiffin's uh, energy and also just the touchdowns and the fist pumps on the sidelines, what does that do for you guys? Oh, that, that is a great motivation for the crowd. You know, we always, always like to keep the crowd involved. Our fans do a great job with the momentum shift when we make plays. Uh, our sideline does a great job. That's very important to us, too. That the sidelines always motivating us and pushing us and driving us uh, when we're out there on the field with this defense or offensive special team. So all that is good. Coach loves it. Coach, coach does it. Everybody does it. Everybody that means that it really shows that everybody's involved with the game and, and watching and focusing in the game because you never know what can happen and you're one play away. When you lost all this, there's some doubts out there whether you would get to this point. How much confidence was there still there that you guys would be where you are now? Well, we always we, after that game we had confidence to know that you know we got to keep we got to keep pounding and, and, and keep our eye on the prize if we're going to do something special with this team. And with that loss, nobody pointed any fingers, nobody shook heads. Everybody knew that we had to get on our ground. We had to really get to it and realize that. This team can do something special, but if we want it, we gotta play every game like it's our lives. You know, even the seniors came up and, and, and set a standard, and everybody followed through it.